Let's take a look at decimal place value. Uh, one thing I've noticed when I've been tutoring students is that people are pretty good with place value with units, tens, hundreds, thousands. Um, for example, they know that the two is in the units column and that the six is in the tens column, but haven't really got a clue on the value of digits after a decimal point. Now the first column after the decimal point is your tenths column. The second is your one hundredths column. Your third is your thousandths column. Your fourth is your ten thousandths column. So as we're going to the right, each column is 10 times smaller than the one to the left. Now it's unlikely you're going to be working beyond say two or three decimal places. So you probably just need to be thinking of the tenths, hundredths and thousandths. So what is the place value of seven in 10.783? Well, it's the first column after the decimal point. So that is our tenths column. So it has a value of seven tenths. The value of five in 3.7058. So this is the tenths column. This is the one hundredths. So this is the thousandths column. So it has a value of five thousandths. And the six in 47.862, or the eight is in the tenths. The six, the six is in the hundredths. So it has a value of six hundredths.